Hey there, gamers. Welcome back to our GTA 5 series. Today, we're diving into something truly epic, the 100% Completion Challenge. That's right. We're on a mission to conquer Los Santos and Blaine County like never before, achieving every single achievement this game has to offer. Check this Hey there, fellow gamers. Welcome back to a brand new episode. In our previous episode, we embarked on a whirlwind adventure through the streets of Los Santos and tackled some incredible missions. Here's a quick recap of the thrilling missions we completed. Friends reunited. We also got trading pure alpha achievement. We purchased a property and a vehicle, pulling one last favor. It's been an incredible journey so far and we're getting closer and closer to that 100% completion mark. So, without further ado, let's jump into today's episode and see what new adventures await in the world of GTA 5. Watch the clutch. I'm ready to go. Are you?
Oh, you shitting me, right? See you later. Hey, hi, what's going on? You cleaning up every damn race, that's what's going on. You gonna let someone else win sometime? Shit, you keep pushing me to get involved? Yeah, I learned that one the hard way. But seriously, man, just wanted to say I'm impressed. I'll see you around. Boy, do I envy you. Living outside the rules. I wish I could, but I'm a stickler. It's my curse. Oh, not this again. I was in a gang once in high school. Well, more of a club. We were light on the intimidation factor. You must have so many stories. Go on, tell me one. Just one. Come on, please. All right, all right, look. I'm going to tell you a story. I'm going to tell you a good one about a gun store owner who wouldn't shut up until one day a customer lost his cool and dropped the annoying son of a bitch. Gotcha. Point taken. We'll stick to the business at hand. I just feel immediately less cool when you walk in. Regret it. You took that well. Gracias.
Later. What up? Ready for a rad tat? Maybe a naked lady tattoo today? Thanks! I need the cash. Later. Looks good. Yeah, I like it. Now, I'm telling you, if you don't sleep in that hairnet, you're gonna wake up with your brains in your pillow, dig? All right, I hear you. See ya. You ready for a trim? Let's see what you like. Oh, yeah. It's fine. Yep. Come back anytime. man and I'm a hypocrite what a gentleman and for once I'm not being sarcastic Yours? Of course not. I have only got myself to blame for the mess these kids are in. You are either drunk or you're staring miserably at the clouds or you're out there doing God only knows what. Oh, yeah. I've done horrible by you. Pulled you out of a Midwestern trailer park, got you a big mansion in Rockford Hills. Hell, the only thing you got to worry about anymore is. What part of your body you want to have chopped off or sucked out again? Screw you, Michael. Ah, but you won't. I was faithful to you up until I found you in a stripper. <laughs> I would divorce your ass if I could. You are nothing but a murdering, cheating hypocrite. Thank you, Michael, whatever the fuck our fake last name is. You have ruined my serenity yet again. My yoga is fucked. Oh, is that what they're calling it now? You and your fucking yoga. Did someone say yoga? Oh, hello, Fabian, darling. Namaste. Namaste. You must be Mikhail. Namaste. Hmm. 
Nah, Michael, fuck yourself. Michael! You've got to work on your anger, brother. It's killing you. Yeah, tell me about it. Ah! There you are, you little shit. Are you looking for this? Ah, 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 ah. No. Very funny. You know, you're a real asshole. What did you just fucking say to me? Stop it! You two, you're ruining my fucking yoga! Somebody say yoga? <gasps> Trevor? Michael. Hey. <laughs> it's good to see you, man. Mm, yeah, I bet it is. Of course, I'm not the one that's been resurrected. Ain't this grand, huh? Yeah, well, I got in a bit of an awkward situation. Mm, you're telling me, bro. Yeah. One of those fake your own deaths to your best buddy, and then run off with the dough, and then live in a big mansion. Awkward situations. It's one way of looking at it. Yeah, do you have any other ways of looking at it? Because I am all out. It was a long time ago, man. I've been in witness protection. I still am. That's great. That's great. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Where are my manners, right? <laughs> Amanda, it is good to see you. Oh, I missed you. You used to be fatter. <laughs> nice new tits, by the way. Jimmy, you, you used to be thinner. But, yeah, uh, can't blame you. Who are you? Namaste. I'm Fabian. Uh, good lord. Where's Tracy? Where's your sister, Jim? Um, sh she's, a, uh, she's, a. Uh, she's trying out for TV. She's what? Yeah, she's auditioning for fame or shame. Fame or shame? The fuck are you talking about? You know, it's that talent slash skills show. She loves it, you guys know that. What's her talent? Dancing. Oh, Christ, she's a horrible dancer. Michael! Come. She might disagree with you on that. <sighs> Jesus Christ, what, now? Now? Where? Um, the Mays Bank Arena. Oh, little Tracy being humiliated. Let's go, we go get her. We? Yeah, we. What are you gonna stand here and argue while your daughter becomes a national laughing stock? Huh? You're worse than I thought. Now let's go. Come on. All right. So, Mike, what were you doing? I was making myself a juice. Brock. Raw kale, fish oil. This recipe I got is packed with nutrients, fibers, vitamins, and they don't taste bad. I'll send you the recipe. Anyway, get this. I'm making it. The blender slips. Juice goes everywhere. I'm about to clean it up when I find this bag of grass. Big fucking bag. Jimmy's, right? Okay, just that moment, Amanda comes in. Sees me there with. I didn't ask for a blow by blow of how you lost your last ounce of masculine pride. I wanted to know what you've been doing for a decade. Easy, T. Don't T me. Hey, if anyone needs kale, my friend. I'm beyond Pam, okay? It's too late for Pam. And it's magical powers to have any effect on me. Fine. Or yoga, or talk therapy. I'm a crank, cannibalism, an incest kind of guy. Oh, don't worry, T. They'd skip that talk and go straight to shock treatment with your ass. You two chilled out to say my name, you fat slob. You two relaxed when you laid back Los Santos embarrassment, huh? Is one letter all you can bring yourself to wrap your slothful lips around? Whoa, dude, you do not let the fuck up. I got ten years worth of venting to do. The let up, my friend, is a long way off. Fine, fine. Do what the fuck you want. Want? Well, I, I want to save your daughter from making an ass of herself. Oh, really, man? Really? Got hey, it's showtime, kids. You, you can't park there. Production vehicles only. 
Oh, oh God! Hey! What was that? <laughs> Come on, you <laughs> dipshit. Did you wait? Ah, that host, man. He's like any closeted TV presenter. Bitter as fucking vinegar. Huh? Where the fuck are they? Hello, sir. May I please have your name? Where the fuck is Tracy Townley, huh? Tracy fucking DeSanta. Fuck, screw that! Where the fuck's Laszlo? All right. Yeah. That was really... All right. It's the auditions, Fame or Shame, season 14, right here in Vinewood, San Andreas. Coming up next, it's Tracy DeSanta. Judges, Tracy DeSanta. Yes. Hi. All right. Tracy's a dancer, but she also likes acting, modeling, and working with children. That's, that's beautiful. You're so original, like oh. a, a basket full of puppies or a <laughs> rainbow or a pile of puke. Oh. Who are these clowns? That's my dad and Trevor? Two dads. Uh, <laughs> Great. Wow. Very San Andreas. What are you guys doing here? Yeah, what are you uh, doing here? Okay, I'm back. Relax, chill, make yourself at home. We've got a little show to do here. Okay. Three, two, one. All right, it's fame or shame for Tracy DeSanta. Mute. Security! Uh, Security! No. What you fucking Hold say? It, come on, big guy! Oh, come on, right there! No. Go. Fuck no. off! Come here, you little shit! No. Tracy, go home. I just wanna talk to you. Ah, ah. they towed us. We gotta take the truck. Right. The thing is, my son just came out of my There, we take the truck. Hey! Hey! Not my ring! Let's get that trip. Look! He went left! How can you sit there and watch your daughter get treated like that? Hey, you raise a daughter in this town, you get used to stunts. It's poor parenting! Yeah, thanks for the fucking feedback. It means a lot coming from you. No one's getting in the way of the big rig! We'll flatten this dick. <laughs> Fucking Laszlo! I knew he was an asshole. Just push him off the fucking road! It's only a battery car, come on! This ain't exactly a racer. We gotta go to the left. Best is going on through the train tracks. We can have a little fun with him, but let's not try to kill this prick, all right? When we crush his little toy car, who knows what'll happen to him? He took a left. I knew this city would be full of douchebags. Can we speed it up a little? Huh? Maybe by throwing your fat carcass over the side. Right, up there. Head right up here. Can't get enough of the celebrities, can you? Ten fucking minutes in LS. Shut up! That cocksucker might be famous, but oh! We'll get him! We'll get him! But well, we're sure taking our time about it. Ah, ah! He's going down into the L.S. River. 
I can see that. I hate that closeted man whore on the TV. I hate him on the radio. I hate him even more in person. He was never funny. The little shit's all out of juice. Hey, 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 you guys. You run out of batteries, huh? I didn't mean anything by it, all right? Oh, yeah? Well, that little girl sat on my lap when she was two years old, and I swore to God that I would rip the fucking skin off anyone who fucking wronged her. Look, I'm just a dumb A-list celebrity trying to entertain America, okay? I got a lot of stuff going on right now, dude, besides you trying to kill me. Now I got multiple sexual harassment lawsuits, plus I'm an addict, all right? And I've relapsed. I can't stop jacking, dude. I jack it in traffic. What's your talent, uh, huh? I mean, aside from love and sex. Dude, haven't you seen my show? It's not live, it's not funny. That's my genius, I got no fucking talent. You clearly ain't being humble, T. Uh, you proved your point. Uh, this is your daughter. You should be wanting to rip the fucking ponytail off the back of this guy's head. And you! Huh? Pants off. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay. There you go. Uh, uh, All right. What are you doing? Now, I want you to dance sexy, celebrité. Mm -hmm. I mean, I need music or... Are you trying to fucking annoy me, huh? I'll, I'll dance. Good. <laughs> All right, all right, now drop it like it's hot, all right? I want to see you get nice and low. Come on, lower, lower, come on. Oh, please don't kill me, okay? I'm supposed to be on a magazine cover next week. All right, all right, come on, get up. Take off, go, now, before I change my mind. I got it all on my camera, you fucking pussy. The world's gonna see your shit. I'm going home. How the fuck did you do it without me for nine years, huh? <laughs> oh, shit. Dave. We need to talk. I was about to tell you the same thing. Okay. Meet me at Galileo Observatory as soon as you can get there. Okay. Somebody, please! My friend is hurt! Someone, do something! Please! Okay, don't... That is all for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoying this series. I will see you all in my next video, take care.